Hey, good morning, Summit. This is Edward. You know this guy, Jake, and this is your weekly update. It's been a long time since we've been together. I think you were saying like a month long ago. Uh, I had uh, Rona, so I was down for two videos. Mm -hmm. And then you uh, had the, your dad and all that, so you were down for two videos. It has been a while. It has been a while. So, hey, make sure you share this on your platforms, on uh, Facebook, uh, MySpace, Twitterverse, YouTube, Instagram, Twitterverse, SnapMonkey, uh, Netflix, uh, all of those, uh, even, yeah, even Roku, put it on Roku, I don't know, I don't know how you do that. YouTube. But, hey, got an exciting Sunday coming up this week, I'm really stoked about this Sunday, I know last Sunday Mark did a great job, I got to watch that, and a great job bringing him one in. One another in one another, you know, yeah. I learned something about that when I was typing the title of his sermon, uh, one anothering, it's not actually a word because it kept coming up, you know, in a word document with a little red line that says you've misspelled something. So I clicked for the right spelling. It's not a word, but it's the great principle, one anothering, one another. I was about to spill your coffee. We were getting excited just then. Mark did a great job last week, trained our small group leaders. Jake is going to be uh, sharing this Sunday. Uh, you got want to give a preview of that where you're going? <clears throat> gonna be talking about a lot of things. Gonna be gearing us up for groups. We're launching groups this Sunday, so we're gonna be talking about. We're gonna be back in uh, John 17 where Jesus Good. was yeah. praying, yeah. talking about kind of the church we want to attend, what that looks like, and how groups fit into that. So yeah, I'm excited. I, I always like talking. You know, I like to hear myself talk. I like to just talk. Sometimes I'll just stand in front of the mirror in the bathroom, get out of the shower, and I'll just talk. Of, or in front of a camera. Uh, love it. Like, like now. Love it. Uh, what else we got? We got, uh, is there anything going on after this church this Sunday? After uh, this Sunday, no. But no, this Sunday. No, this is a fifth Sunday, unique Sunday, fifth okay, Sunday. Right, so, Kid Venture right. Kids, you know, y'all always do something really cool on the fifth Sunday. <clears throat> and then our Kid Venture Kids are meeting on Wednesday nights. Yep. Again, so uh, kind ministry. kindergarten through second grade this next Wednesday, student ministry is meeting on Wednesday nights. Mm -hmm. A lot of stuff going on you need to be aware of. Um, yeah, excited. Uh, I did spill my coffee. I told you, I've already warned you. <laughs> Good thing I'm wearing a waterproof jacket. <laughs> Dude, that's, you remind me of my dad. My dad couldn't do anything without spilling yeah. something on his shirt, man. Yeah. So you're a good company. You're just trying to kind of remember right that's now. right that's, that's what I'm doing. hey don't forget next month's february you know what happens in february jake super bowl oh valentine's day gotta think of your sweetheart so be thinking about that give me a little extra warning i think about my like sweetheart that. super bowl i throw her a super bowl party yeah, every year i'm not sure that's really what that's meant to do but uh anyway hey uh don't forget about super uh, i almost said it valentine's day uh, Summit, we love you. You got anything else to Man, do this week? I am just excited to be a part of Summit Heights Fellowship. This whole series that we've been talking about, Real Church. Yeah. I'm just so excited to be a part of a real church and uh, excited about what God's doing. So y'all come Sunday and be willing to be open to connect. We're going to be talking about that a lot. Yeah, and I'll tell you this, Jake. Just what we've walked through the last two weeks. I said this at my dad's service. I'll say this. To all of you, uh, if it wasn't for my small group, for Danielle and I's small group, uh, this last two weeks would look totally different. Yep. Uh, yep. From meals to support to just loving on us. Um, it, it's I don't know how people do it without a small group. I'll be honest with you. I, I, I don't know how. And, and I think this week, uh, while I already knew that, yeah. I experienced it firsthand in a real tangible way. And I've done that in the past. I felt that in the past. This week, though, it's just been... Uh, incredible. So I would say to you, if you're not in a small group, you need to be in a small group. Uh, it, it's that one another in one another. And uh, we're on the receiving end of that still. Uh, in fact, we'll, we're going to cook a meatloaf tonight that was delivered to us from I one of our like small groups. Uh, he passed it, it's, away too. It's phenomenal. Last week. Yes, I heard that. I heard that. Heard that. So anyway, uh, this Sunday's going to be a great Sunday. If you haven't connected, you want to connect. You just wrote my message. I don't even know that I have to preach now. Uh, it's good. I'm telling you. I, I, I just, uh, every day, the hospital at mom's uh, my small group's been driving a long view yep. that that's the power of small groups yep. uh every night to deliver food i tell you what yeah it was awesome for me to go to the hospital and see your small group bring food because i was hungry and that pizza was outstanding we had pizza king one night up there it was outstanding we had pizza two times up there that somebody brought so, that, that so was cool. hey get into a small group for no other reason than pizza than pizza pizza, pizza. Anything else for real? I know.
Hey, we love you, son. I can't wait to see you Sunday. I'll be there. Uh, can't wait to see you. Uh, 10 o'clock Sunday morning. Uh, share this. Invite somebody. If you're joining us online, uh, invite people to watch online. Let's get the word out. Let's get the message out. Let's get the gospel out that Jesus is the king. He loves you. And uh, let's, let's make the Sunday a cool day. So we love you. Post this on your outlines.